Also to the people who think that they can probably come out making statements to intimidate and do all that. We want to tell them that life will become very uncomfortable for them. So they shouldn't even try. Because at the end of the day, when you do anything and the escalation fails, you do anything and engagement fails, when we come and we we'll come with the full force of the law in a manner that dignify us as a people, please don't complain. And it is here that we want to seek your support as we do that in a way that the people will know that at the end of the day, if the police also get it right, they have people to speak for them. Then the normal issue that when we get it right, it's no news, it's normal. But as soon as we seem to got it wrong, even if the facts are not clear, it's a big news. Let's help ourselves to avoid that. So in summary, in terms of the preparation for the election, this is just the excerpt I want to give you to be comfortable and use it to tell your people who listen to you across the country that Ghana will continue to enjoy the peace that it has been enjoying during this period of the election. And even that peace, because of the way all of us will work together to prosecute this election in a manner that winners will know that they have won. Losers will also know that they have lost and they have lost fairly. And therefore, they have no business trying to incite anybody to do anything that will disturb the peace will be clear in their mind and there will be no motivation for them to do that. And this country will continue to enjoy the peace that we cherish so dearly, for which we have become the envy of the rest of the continent. I am telling you here that I will only come in this 7th December within the Achimansa enclave. When police tells me that they come out, and when I come, I will not talk. I will beat you and the hell will you. I always want people to try me. So those of us seated here, any of you can try me on that day, or try any of my men on that day. When you go to the polling station, just cast your vote, go home, go and sleep. Thank you. When it is 5 p.m., come, they will tell you where to stand. They will count for you. If you win, clap, go home. Then you will not have any problem with me and then my people. We are not going to sit down for just two or three people to distort the peace that Ghana is enjoying. That is why I don't vote. I don't want to belong to anybody. I want to beat everybody. <laughs> we have a duty as religion or religious heads, as security heads, as family heads, as individuals to protect the good things that we have as a country. And the only good thing we have as a country now is the peace that we are enjoying. <laughs>